moving on, we go from his right back to the kitchen. Mug thing. These cups are gross. Toss them. Some little cups, but they're all branded for a living senior living place. Some plastic dishes I can never. Usually our goodwill won't even take those, so. These are like a little six cup set of shot glasses. A couple little wall hanging things. And this is all like plastic dishware that our goodwill usually doesn't even take, so. And I can't get rid of them, so. I'll just probably pitch this box. This one is marked shot glasses, which that looks like that's what it is. That one's open. That one's new. A little flask. A little bottle opener. And then I think these are all just going to be shot glasses, so I'll just get through these real quick. Looks like all just normal glass ones are plastic for some reason wrapped up. So, finish this off and grab another box. Two more boxes. This looks like it's all different kitchen stuff. Which, I mean, it all sells if it's in good shape. I put it out of the flea market for 25 cents a piece and People buy it up. Well, that goes like that. That's really it. A lot of the other stuff is just like plastic little tongs and stuff. Like nothing really special. Tongs. Well, that's really it in that one. <laughs> Looks like we've got another bathroom. I think that's new. It's starting to get hot. That's used. That's used. Used, used. That's used. Used. Oh, I was hoping for a jewelry box, but it's just a whole bunch of nail clippers. A little curling iron. This thing's gross. Like it's disgusting. A little 
flat iron. This one's a nice shape. Shower curtain holders. Another shower curtain. Another shower curtain liner. And that's it. Another pair of scissors. But that's it for those boxes. So in the bottom of that little pink container, there was this little necklace. It's missing the clasps on it, but it looks like it's probably gold. So part of a necklace or a bracelet or something. Definitely have to test that guy. There went in our test bag. By the sound of this one, yep, sound of the kitchen. That guy's rusted up. Getting bright. A little strainer thing. Got a little pot. A lid. A little cake pan. A couple more lids. Another strainer. That guy's gross in there camera doesn't do it justice and then there's a pan down here that has rat stuff all over it so I'm not even touching that but I'm gonna have to put most of this aside for when I find more pots and pans so I can match lids and everything so moving on Ooh, all right this looks like mainly discs I guess These are all just copy discs Yeah, this is all just discs. We'll go through this off camera real quick. And then... when it's cold outside. It works. And that one has food. A lid. And a nasty old crock pot. All right, that's it. Yeah, that's everything in that one. So this box says living room stuff and tax papers. So let's see what we have. There's personal information. Look like targets. And they are some targets. Mouse poop. And some more personals. Fifth Avenue little crystal little crystal cup thing. A jar. Right there. Phone book. Little base. Oh, Something wrapped up inside of a bag. David's cookies. cookie jar right there that cool this is the big guy in flea market what do we have here some sort of screen spray that's been used some scissors and pencils and pens Always look in the bottom of those cups, there's two pennies. 
Every penny counts. President Barack Obama com commemorative figure. See if it's worth anything. Got here a couple pens. A cup with nothing in it. A plastic cup. A pen and some other junk. Some seashells. It's like a candle holder. Let's see if we can get something for it. Literal rocks. Let's sure wrap this stuff up. A little paperweight thing. I can never get anything for those. A little bell. That's covered in glitter. I'm not screwing with glitter. Some more glitter. statue. Okay. And then some coasters and that's it really a couple that's well, they're stuck together. A candle, a rock, and then this little box with some just writing paper on it. And it looks like we've got some more kitchen stuff that is in really bad shape. That looks about like the only piece I'm going to be able to salvage out of this. everything else I mean, look at that it's just this whole box is just a scrap yard no problem I'll make some money off of it better than throwing it out all right so I just did a couple of boxes there was one that was marked uh, glasses like glassware and stuff and like just about every single thing in there was broken so I just did that real quick you could just hear it when you moved it and then I just did a box of pictures but now we're moving on and it looks like we've got a box of shoes. Those are beat. Got some sandals here. A little pair of almost heels. A pair of flats. Another pair of sandals. My lights just went off. Another pair of shoes here. Not too bad. A pair of boots here. Right there. I think this is all shoes. A 
Another pair of boots here. Not the bad shape. Put one sandal. There's the other one. There. And we've got a pair of flats here. Another pair there, and there's something blue all over my hands that I just realized. That's fun. Some champion shoes, those look pretty, pretty beat up. Another pair of sandals there. Pair of sandals right there. pair of shoes so that's it in that box so I'm gonna put these away and clean off my hands something blue all over them now we've got a tote here with what looks like a lot of Christmas stuff and I know people get mad when I throw away a bunch of stuff but the thing is is Christmas stuff I one time at a flea market sold two entire tables full of stuff for like five bucks to someone beat just to get rid of it because Christmas stuff never moves. I can never get rid of it, but maybe there's something else in here. A little light up party LED sign. It says try me, but I don't know how. Yeah, still a cool little sign. Oh, it says pray, not party. The complete opposite. <laughs> Whoops. Like, this kind of Christmas stuff I can't even give away. Half the time our Goodwills won't even take that stuff either. So. That's all bulbs or Christmas tree ornaments or whatever. So is that. That is everything that's left in here. So, I'm just gonna pitch everything. Alright, next box. Torn up piece of fabric. Got some sun hats. Some hair extensions. More wigs. That's kind of cool. Floats back and forth. I believe these are wigs. Yeah, they're wigs, but I think they're all brand new. So I'm going to have a whole bag of them. I'm going to look these up and see if they work anything. Oh, looks like a whole other bag of them. They're brand new wigs. Disposable cameras, two disposable cameras, and this is personals. Someone's gonna do these guys off camera. And the next box. We're almost done with this trailer, actually. Oh, it's a purse wrap. There we go. Just some pins. Oh, there's five cents. Oh, just pens in that basket. 
basket can't be better shape. So the basket. Part of a makeup kit. And we'll pull this one thing nail polish out because we still have the nail polish. Another cup of pens. Glass. A Rolodex. Wow. I haven't seen one of these in a while. A little um, air mattress pump. That's kind of cool. It's a big key. It's heavy. It's metal. Highlighters that are going everywhere. Some flowers in the bottom. A little fish and tackle box. I thought that was real for a second, but it's not. Speakers. Yeah, someone might buy those. Little notepads. Used coloring book. Got an air mattress. It's just broken. Some pencils. Iron. And some speakers. That's all in that one. Alright guys, and we're on to another box here. Big old box. Some more plastic bowls. They have a lot of them. A broken vase. Steel nutcracker set. Okay, just some normal nutcrackers. Book. Official bartender's guide. 1957. Someone might buy that. A deluxe nutcracker set. Stick and clip lights. So they're just some little. LED lights. I'll see over there. I do not think these are silver. I will have to look into them, little candlesticks. I don't think they're silver, but they might be. There's a penny. Flashlight. Yeah, it works. A little bowl of glass thing. Nothing in that container. It's pretty beat up. A little LED lantern. It's as seen on TV, so I'm going to look it up on eBay because a lot of as seen on TV stuff will sell. Wallet, which looks pretty empty. Pretty sure there's nothing up in here. Oh, nice little wallet. Though. What else do we have here? This is drug reference the book. Some tape. Earwax thing. 
Look at that guy, because it's new. Take my It's a good eBay shipping box. Journal thing. The rats ate the soap. Cord. Digital scale. That's brand new. Paperweight. A metal spinning photo frame. That's brand new in the box as well. Little thing like that there. A flower leaf fountain. That's brand new in the box. I've seen that these have been selling okay online. I actually listed a couple of them. So I'm gonna look that guy up. I think these are dominoes. Yeah, I think a dominoes. It's missing a bunch in there. It's all messed up. A portable ultrasonic humidifier. I think it's used, but it's in good shape. Instabulb. That's brand new as seen on TV once again. Look that guy up. It's getting hot out here. A votive candle set. That is brand new. Candle set. Little glasses, but a couple of them are broken. I can hear it. They're small champagne glasses, maybe. Little clock with stuff in it, with a pill in it. And a battery. There's another battery stuck in there. A little clock, nothing special. Plastic. And then there's this case down there. Which if I had to guess, it would probably be a serving set. It doesn't feel heavy enough. Yeah, that's what it is. B Sterling. Gorham Sterling. That piece is Sterling. That's Sterling. I think this all might be Sterling. Yep, it's all Mark Sterling. That's awesome. Now, does this piece Sterling? Yep, that one's Sterling. That's stainless, but I suspect it probably has a sterling handle. See what about this piece? Sterling. Let me move this box and then I'll show this set. So here's the set here. There's four of these spoons, some serving spoons. I don't know if that one's actually sterling or not. That one I'm not sure. But like everything's marked, most of it's marked Gorham Sterling right there. And there's a bunch of these little forks. A couple of them that are brand new in the packaging. Three of them that are brand new. This knife here. Like this big server is marked Gorham Sterling Handle Stainless Blade. So that's actually a really cool set. I've never found really sterling flatware like this. So that's pretty cool. I was looking up, I mean, there was a couple where like a couple spoons were going for like 30 or 40 bucks a piece. So hopefully we've got some good money here. But that's a nice find out of these units that are doing really well. So I can't really complain there. I like that. Alright guys, so all I really have left to do 
off is this box, which is just kitchen wares. And then we have, this box is a deep fryer that is just destroyed. This is all books. This is more just kitchen stuff. Found this cordless, what was it, staple gun, tacker, flashlight set. It looks like it's almost new. Lincoln Log, Singer's Home Machine. This is like a bunch of party stuff, so nothing really there. And then, that's all scrap. And then I just have these two bags of toys and those two totes of clothes. So I'm just going to knock out what I can real quick and then I'll give you an update. All right guys, so everything in this trailer is basically done except for these two bags and those two totes. That's the aluminum um, cookware or whatnot. This box is scrap. There's a microwave under there. That's going to the scrap yard. These are all just empty boxes. This one's completely full of clothes. So when I go to bag up all those clothes in there, I'm just going to bag these up too. I do have this little pack and play I need to open up and see. I got a buddy of mine who's buying that cast iron for 60 bucks. And then looked up a few things. I still got to look up all that tote. Looked up everything over here and put a bunch in the truck and everything that was piled up there. But I'm basically done for today. I got to go over to a friend's of mine's house and look at some stuff that he said I might be interested in. So we're going to take a peek at that. The flea market has grown immensely. I really need to reorganize this place. It's so bad. But this is also a scrap box. Scrap pile got pretty big. So I am sweaty. But we're heading out of here. So I'll catch you guys later.